Your skin is the largest organ of your body and sends you important signals every day. But do you know what to do to help protect and keep your skin healthy as the seasons change? Here to talk about this is Dr. Rosemary Ingleton, who's a New York City-based dermatologist and director of the Ingleton Dermatology Clinic. Welcome back, doctor. Good to be here. How are you? I'm very well. So, so important as the seasons are changing, we need to talk about skin a little bit and what we need to do. But first, how about a little skin 101? Two basic layers of the skin, starting with the epidermis, is the outer layer of skin, as you know. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's composed of multiple layers. Starting at the top, we have that corneum layer or keratin letter, layer, which is essentially dead skin cells. That's providing that barrier between us and the outside world. That's where we're putting all of those lotions and creams right. and makeup right. and sunscreen. Mm -hmm. And then finally, we work our way down. We have multiple layers of cells. The bottom layer of the epidermis actually is a constantly regrowing new cells that work their way up to the top. So we're actually reforming new skin every 30 exactly. days. Exactly. So you have the epidermis, which Dr. Orton just spoke about, which is the purple area. Everything below it down to this point is the dermis. The dermis has a lot of the nutrient providing functions of the skin here. We've got the hair follicle, you have big fat hair, you've got your oil gland or your sebaceous gland, and you have blood vessels and lymphatic vessels. Um, you have sweat glands here. The sweat glands are actually what regulates, well, helps to regulate your body's uh, temperature. And the blood vessels help to bring nutrients to your skin and supply the epidermis with what it needs to stay healthy looking. So now that we understand what's going on in the inside of our skin, here's why it's important to put your skin first and make it an essential part of your daily health care routine. The skin, we have to remember, is the first line of defense we have. It's what is impacted by the environment. It's our big organ, um, our biggest organ. And as the seasons change, climate changes, your skin has to respond to that. And the way it responds when it gets colder is it gets dry. Mm -hmm. It can get chafed. It can get itchy, scale. What we do is we have to change our skincare regimen. And protecting from the wind is so important, too, because that's very drying. This time of year, the winds pick up. In my practice, anyway, I end up telling a lot of patients in the wintertime to use a product that has heavy moisturizers and maybe a little alpha hydroxy. Um, I like Eucerin Plus Smoothing Essentials Lotion, the alpha hydroxy, which helps to get those dead, scaly cells off. Mm -hmm. And as the fresher cells come to the surface, it, it, the rich moisturizers in there help the surface to look smoother and more hydrated and traps the moisture inside. So that's something that's very easy to do. In my life, I should say, as a dermatologist, I put my skin health first every day. So, and I like to encourage patients and the audience to do a similar thing by taking the Eucerin Skin First Pledge. For our viewers out there, we want you to log on to the doctorstv.com if you are willing to take this pledge. And Dr. Ingleton, you have something special for the people here in the audience, right? Yes, we do. I think you're going to like this. You're getting this Eucerin Skin Health Kit so that you guys can get on the road to putting your skin health first every day. Good stuff. 